Welcome to Manage Engine Applications Manager video tutorial series. In this video, I'll show you how to add HTTP sequence monitor. For this, I'm going to click on new monitor, add new monitor. Let me scroll down and select URL sequence. Here, you need to click on download and install, which means you need to download a recorder tool. So this tool is used in order to record a sequence. So when you click on it, it will take us to the web page where you can download the exe file. The total size is 1.6 MB, so the installation will not take much time. I've already downloaded it in my computer, so I'm going to show you that folder. So it is in my machine under D ME transaction recorder and under bin folder you will find the exe. So I'm going to launch this. And this is the application that will pop up. So now I want to record a URL sequence. So let me go ahead and type in the website that I want to record. Hit enter key. Click on the sequence that you want to monitor. And then you need to click preview and save. Once you are done, you can click on it. It will ask you for the application manager detail. So I'm going to type in there the details of where my application manager is running, the port information. In case if you are using HTTPS, you can provide the SSL port here. So the username and password and click login. Once this is done, you will see the sequence that has been captured in application manager using this recorder too. Now in case in this sequence, if you want to remove a link that you do not want, say for example, image file or video file or any other link, you can just click on it and click delete URL on the right top. Once this is done, it will remove the URL link from the recorder tool. So I'm going to use my delete key in the keyboard and I'm going to remove some of the URLs that I don't want to monitor. Even this, you can remove it from the monitor page. So here it is. Now let me click on next. Provide the sequence name, the polling interval and verify if the host name and port number of my application manager is correct. Once it is done, click on save. Now you can close this window and quit the application. Go back to the application manager UI. Click on the arrow mark beside monitors. I can see that my sequence has been captured. You can click on the individual sequence and get, gather the details such as the availability, response time, page size, and time splitter. Thank you for watching this video. Have a nice day.